Talking up all kinds of stuff. Mm. Last night was still pretty rough. The vlog for today is like ridiculously long. Um, but it probably would have been 20 minutes shorter um, if I if we didn't do the would you rather. But it was literally a spur of the moment choice and decision and I didn't think it was going to go on as long as it did but but it did so I was supposed to go to the gym I think wifey I told her I wanted to sleep in but I still slept I still set my alarm for 7 30 because I wanted to come down make coffee I wanted to try to poop <laughs> before I went to the gym because I don't want to have to go to the bathroom when I'm there because it cuts into my gym time. So, because that's what happened last time we went to the gym. Um, we had we got to stay a little longer because wifey had to poop and she's like, I'm getting all my minutes. And I was like, okay. Um, so... That. And I also want to switch laundry over and get the towels in the wash. So this thing was empty. I think. I've really been struggling with the thought and the idea of getting that new Keurig that does the iced coffee. But this one holds so much water, and I don't think the other one, and it's going to drive me crazy, like, after two cups of coffee, you have to refill it. Because we ain't about that life. Callie, you just, you guys just ate. It is so cold down here. I just put the little heater on. My pants are sliding down. It's 29 degrees. Why? Why is it so cold? It's March. 29 fucking degrees. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Right, Callie? Ridiculous. Hi. Hi. It's my creamer. See? I don't know how long we are going to be out today. Look. There's literally crumbs. That's it. Look. That's it. Mixie. It's it's crumbs. It's literally crumbs. That's it. Oh my god. It's it's crumbs. That's it, it's all gone. Dunzo. Dun Damn, why'd you come out like that? Cats are fed, the treats are gone. I think wifey just got up, which sucks for me. Because I'm gonna do it in the bathroom and stuff. Oh. God, why 
why is it so why is it gotta be so fucking cold it's like 65 in the house but it's like freezing i don't know how foodie beauty well i do know because when i used to be 400 fucking pounds soon as it hit 68 i'd start sweating i'd start fucking sweating It'd be 60 degrees out, which sometimes when it's 60 degrees out, now I do it, I just open the windows. But when I was 400 pounds, I would open that fucking window, freeze everybody else off, and I'd still be sweating. So I can only imagine how cold Foodie has her apartment, for real. So... All right, I'm trying to look for my, um, I got that blister from on the back of my heel still. It keeps cracking open and then it gets this big scab. Where are my gym shoes? I feel a little frazzled for no reason. I don't, I don't know why. All right, let me drink my coffee. go swap laundry and I will see you guys at the gym all right I am here at the gym and it is crowded as a motherfucker it said that the crowd meter was low this ain't fucking low mm. All right, somebody is actually on my arc trainer. So I'm gonna actually do a real elliptical today. All right, I've been on the elliptical for 16 minutes. I'm trying to hit one mile. This is not the best time, but I burnt 171 calories. I wanted to get a mile under 15, but I haven't really a little out of the loop with this, but. I'm still getting her done. like every damn machine I have gotten on is gonna break. I actually got on my ab machine I was watching that shit like a hawk. There's actually this couple here. You can tell it's like an athletic couple. I'm surprised they're not vloggers or something because they got matching outfits on. He's got on black pants and a neon orange shirt and she's got on neon orange leggings with a black tank top. I'm like, look at y'all with the same damn shoes. I'm like, are y'all vloggers or something? What is up, beautiful souls? All right, I just got my shower. I'm gonna put some happiness on my face. I'm gonna make a cup of coffee. It was so busy at the gym. Like, it was a little too busy. Like, I don't, I genuinely don't mind it. What annoys me is, and it's, it's, it's a me thing. It's not like, it's, 
it's it's a it's a very very thing it's not like anybody else's thing it's like when i'm waiting okay I got scared because I thought you wanted to be here and someone on the wall. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, do you see a robe on the couch? Yeah. <laughs> Nixie's up scared of the container. Um, I'm like really hungry. Um,. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, it, I know it's a Ray Ray thing, but, like, and I think it's, like, a, a, a Ray Ray ADHD thing. If anybody else here has ADHD and they go to the gym, let me know if it's just me or, like, do you guys get this certain way? So, of course, we go to a Planet Fitness near us, and, um, so, we went to the Planet Fitness. And which is where we usually go. And I usually have like a routine. And my routine is I get one either. Well, I was pissed because all my arc trainers were done. But then I got on the elliptical, which I actually like, I don't mind the arc trainer. Like you would think the arc trainer would hurt my knees, but it doesn't. If anything, my knee was like throbbing by the time I got done. We have no treats. There's no treats. None. Empty. None. Um... So are the, all the ARC trainers were taken. So there was that. So I was like, fuck. So I got on the elliptical and I did my routine. And usually after that, the first thing I like to do is the ab machine. But the ab machine was taken. So I was like, fuck. So I was like, I had to readjust my thing. So I went and did my legs. I did my, my gluteus maximus. And then I was like, oh, cool. I was like, the leg machine or the ab machine is free. I get off the gluteus maximus machine and I walk over or I start cleaning it because you have to clean the machines when you're done. I clean the machine. I look over. There's a girl on it. I was like, motherfucker. So I went to the other leg machine and I kept looking over and I kept looking over. And when she got off of it and wiped it down, I hopped off real quick. My, I had my towel. My paper towel was soaking wet. I was still able to clean my machine and ran right over to it. So I was able to get on my ab machine. So I did that. I was like getting so annoyed because I wanted to get on it so bad. Mm. Also, my endocrinologist called me. She is changing my medicine. And she is taking me off of um, the Cytomel, which is the T4 stimulant. And she's bumping me back up to the thyroid medicine. And she's putting me on, she's bumping me up to like one, 100 again. Because I feel like I felt better when it was just the 100. I didn't feel like perfect, but I feel like I felt better. And she thinks so too. So I'm just gonna go to the 100. So I gotta remember to save money for that because that's another 80 fucking dollars. So there's that. I think I'm just gonna finish my prescription that I do have until I can get my new thyroid medicine. So dosage. She's still very anti-armor. Come on, dude. it down so I don't know Loki so yeah so there's that um but yeah so I got on I was able to get on my ab machine so I got on my ab machine and then I went over to do the leg machines. I swear I felt like every single machine I got on was like broken or fucked up or something because like I got on the uh, the machine and it was like 
brrr, like it was vibrating and I had it at a very low weight because of my knees and I'm just like yeah I just did a very slow and steady pace for like two minutes because it was on a very low weight if I do low weights I do more reps and if I have it on a high weight I do less weps weps <laughs> reps with a break in between that's how I, that's how I do it oh excuse me um so yeah you know what this is kind of gray no it's blue today's color is gray but I kind of want to wear a crystal and I kind of really want to wear this one I know it's blue-ish but it's kind of giving like gray vibes. So this is what it is today. I'm wearing this one. But yeah, so then I just worked on my arms and stuff. And then I wanted to get on my lateral pull down machine because that's something that I always work on. So I did my shoulders, I did the shoulder press, the seated row, the pull, the chest press. And then I just, I, I, all I wanted to get done was the lateral pull down. So I did end up doing the um, bicep curls or tricep, whatever it is. And then again, once I saw the machine get free, I hopped off mine, wiped it down, look over, there was another girl over there. I'm like, so I looked over at the circuit and that machine was free. So I just went over there. I was just like fuck it I'm just gonna go over there and get my shit done but we worked out for like an hour which is good so and I was kind of not disappointed with myself but I was a little disappointed with myself so I when I used to do the elliptical the elliptical has a timer like a mile thing on there and it shows you the mile and I was almost at one mile and then I wanted to get it under 15 minutes I actually wanted to try to get it in 13 and then, or like between 12 and 13 and do a three minute cool down. But I didn't get it. Like my knee was killing me. And like, I haven't been like on a good elliptical like that in a long time. And um, cause I just put it on quick start workout and it just like randomly, like you're in the middle of a workout and it just like randomly adjusts your incline and your tension and stuff. So, um, I was just like, I felt good though. I love going to the gym so much. I wish I could go all the time. Like when I got off of work, I wish I could just find somebody who would scoop me up, go to the gym, get a fucking killer ass workout done and just be done with it. God damn, that coffee's good. I'm hungry though. I need to eat something. So. <sighs> Alright. We have a busy day. We're going to the mall. So. Like I said, today's color is gray. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know what color what I'm going to wear today. So. Alright, I'll check in after the makeup's done. I'm hot. Just get a little colder. Does anybody else get like really fucking hot after the shower or is it just me? Because I swear when I'm done and out of the shower, I'm fucking sweating buckets all the time. I mean, granted, I'm drinking coffee too, but. Alright, wifey is about ready to go. I just did a quick look. I still have to add my mascara, but basically. I will show you what I use. Just a super quick look. I use the um, cremated palette. I use the color Solemnly Swear R.I.P. and Wednesday. So I use these two colors and this one on my lid. Then I put, um, and I use the black that's in here, which is hers right there for my wing and the crease. Um, and then I put, um, white foundation creamer and I used um, star split and vitamin P this one and this one and I used this highlighter 
So before wifey and I went to the mall, we went to Bandito's for lunch. And oh my God, their tortilla chips are the best I have ever had. They're seasoned and they're like corn tortillas. Oh my God, they're so freaking good. And then I got tacos. I got shrimp tacos, a fish taco in the middle, and then like a different, uh, it was a Peruvian chicken taco. Shopping. Going to the door. Alright, we're at Torrid. Look how cute these are. But they're $69. But I like them because they're short sleeve. Look how cute. To wear with a tank top. Oh my goodness. I like these too. To wear with a tank top. Really? That's so cute. I need to just go check the clearance. This is cute too. It's like tattoo. I don't like that one as much. All right. All right, let's see. I don't really see, this is kind of cute. But I wouldn't wear that. It's cute, but I don't like it. No. This is too dressy for me. I want like a casual. I don't like those. No. Okay. Now I have to go find wifey. She went to Ari, Ari, whatever it is, and to look for bras. I'm gonna go over. Am I going the right way? I don't even know where I'm going. I don't even know where I'm going. Am I even going the right way? Oh, I hate getting lost. Okay, bras pass. Okay, I need to go that way. I have spotted a wild wifey. She's walking down there. Okay. I see her. And, but I found, so I did get one of each. I got the white denim and the white cropped thing. Cropped jean jackets. I got both of those. And I got... I just saw a wifey. I don't know where the hell she went. And um, I got two bras because when they have my bra size, I have to scoop them up. Because if I don't, it's like you snooze, you lose because they never have my bra size. So I got two bras that were on sale. So I only spent $150 on two jean jackets and two bras at Tor. I think that was hella good. And I got double points. And she gave me extra toward hot cash. So, yeah. Score beaches. Oh. Um, I just saw her. She said she wanted to get a um, milkshake. Let me you. you see that man down there, that uh, phone case thing? Do you see him? He was the biggest fucking jerk. I was sitting there talking to him and trying to find a, a different phone case, just looking. And I found one that I wanted that was like my old one. And it was like cooler. And I liked it a lot. And he's like, no, 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 it's for 15. 14s are here. And I said, no, no, no. I said, 15 can fit a 14. No, 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 it's a different phone. And he's arguing with me. And wifey was getting pissed and I was getting annoyed. I'm like, dude, bruh. Like, when you order a phone case, like, it was the same exact phone case that I have now. Was in the 15 that I had on my phone. He said, no, 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 no. These are for 14. I was like, I hear what you're saying, bruh, but they're the same exact fucking phone case. I see you. Look up. Um, do you want a, a milkshake? 
Chick fil A is right there. Up top. Huh? Is Route 21 up here or downstairs? I thought it was this way when we came in. So. Fun stuff. Well, he said she wanted a milkshake, so I told her we'd split one. So. Fun day at the mall. She went all the way down to the other side to get on the escalator to come up here. I know I'm Marshmallow. Beaches. I don't know what this beaches thing is here lately, but it's been a thing. All right, I'm in Rue 21, and everything is buy two, get one free. And they got some of the best jeans. I have so many jeans now. But they have a lot of cute tops. I will show what the girls are looking at me. So, I think that was wifey. Yeah, it's wifey. So, yeah. Oh, they have a cute Hello Kitty top. That's a 2X. I don't know why I want Hello Kitty. I don't know. Let's see. Tailgates. No. They got a ton of cute stuff. I love dump him. Like, look at, like, he's like a lot of teeny boppers. Like, he's like a lot of teeny boppers. Oh my god, I see sparkles. Alright. I don't really like any of that stuff in sync. That's cute. New York City. Are these like bodysuits? No. They're just little tanks, little crops. Mm. As much as I love shopping, home sweet home. So we stopped at the Walmart. We went grocery shopping by the mall. Oh my God. Talk about the most chaotic energy. It was so busy. Very dirty, very not nice people. I'm like, what the fuck? It was horrible there. Oh, my thing came. Remember how I was saying that I wanted um, a shelf for my stove? Well, I found one on yeah, Amazon. I, I know, but I ordered one from Amazon. And it's stainless steel. The thing was 40 fucking dollars. $40. But I need it. Cause we ain't got, this house is filling up full of shit. I need it for some of the sources. Well, I want to clear some of this stuff cause dad's got so much shit. Um, sir, why are you talking to me? You got shit to do. Uh -uh. Sir. Mm. Oh my God. If somebody, if somebody could please tell me how this wasn't magnetic. I got this because it was magnetic because it's a metal stove, but I think it's just plastic. I don't know because the magnets wouldn't stick and they barely stuck to the side of the, the side of the stove. Like it wasn't even that strong. I'm expecting like some earth type magnet, but it came with adhesive strips. So I used all four of those beaches, all four of them. If y'all remind me, I can link them down in the description box so I can show you guys. But for the time being, I need to start unpacking groceries. We got some protein shakes, some milk. I got bread and some snacks. Oh, the Thor. Thor. And then the cats, cat food. I don't know why the cling wrap is over there, but. We didn't actually get much. We spent like $300. I'm like, what the fuck did we get? Because I specifically got this because it was $10. And 
for 28 bags of the other stuff, it was like 20. It was like double the price. And I'm like, what the hell? No, he can, he can eat this. So, all right, let me get this shit sorted out and see what's going on. All right, Walmart grocery haul time. All right, I'm going to start over here. We got a Dawn power wash refill because it's the shit. Wifey loves these butterscotch discs. So we got those. She's so old. She's so old. Anyway, um, and these peanut butter filled pretzel nuggets. We got some walnuts because wifey asked me to make grape salad. I haven't made grape salad in a while, so I'm going to do that. Um, we got, what are these? <laughs> English muffins for hubby's lunch. And then look at these. I've never seen these before. Keto bagel thins. I was like, what? I want to try them. How many net carbs? Two net carbs. So we're going to try those. I got these for me as a snack. If you guys remember, I used to eat these all the time, especially after surgery for a snack. So I'm going to try to go back to some old habits. I did get a bag of jasmine rice because jasmine rice is the best. The saffron rice was okay, but it was like, whatever. We got a triple zero 17 grams of protein yogurt i'm gonna put this in the uh grape salad instead of sour cream i got these for hubby's lunch these are for me now they have a little bit of sugar but i'm gonna try these i love boston cream you guys don't even know um wifey's trail mix we got these for hubby's lunches as well i have another can over on the other counter but red enchilada sauce these were only a dollar and i never seen them that, that cheap um paper plates and eggs because hubby wants to um dye easter eggs he actually brought home these two kits the other day and i'm like really okay whatever. all right so these were only a dollar so i got me one and brayden one I stocked up on my coffee mate creamer. The cats got their damn stinking treats. We got more coffee. There's the other enchilada sauce. More barbecue sauce. Taco sauce. Pedialyte. Wifey puts this in with the uh, ferrets water. Sweet potatoes. I'm going to make sweet potato brownies. Yes, you heard me. Sweet potato brownies. I got the recipe. It's it's gonna go down, okay? I also got these pre-cooked chicken breasts. Like I got seasoned rotisserie and flame grill just for like a quick dinner if I want to make something. I could they're already cooked. I don't have to wait to cook chicken, you know. Free stocked on chicken nuggies because hubby specifically requested chicken nuggies. Nene's, bananas, strawberries, some cucumbers, um, plenty of grapes, and my pepperoni. What else did I get? I showed you the box of chips. Oh, they actually had, we got a case of water, and oh, God, almost fell. And they had the um, Pepsi Max Wild Cherry, but they only had it in cans and not bottles, which is fine. Oh, look, I put my shelf up. I don't know how was it magnetic, but doesn't it look nice? Sorry, ADHD. I had to do it before I could finish groceries. So I did it. I think it looks nice. And I was like shaking because it was making me a little nervous. But I think it'll be all right. Um, and that was it for groceries. Oh, um, cat litter. We got cat litter and um, hubby sodas, a case of his sodas. So, I mean, that was at 300, it was exactly $300, like 301 or something. I was like, are you fucking kidding me? $300 for this little bit of shit? Like seven bags of groceries? <sighs> anyway. All right, let me put this shit away and figure out what we're doing. Like what anybody wants for dinner. Like it's late. It's already seven o'clock. Like, do they just want like a quick dinner or what? I don't know. So I still gotta put everything away. So we'll see. All right, friends, we all just uh, ate dinner. I bit the fuck out of the inside of my mouth and now it's like, it's like back there. I think I've talked about this before. I'll do my little torrid haul. 
Um, I've talked about this before, that since gastric bypass, I bite the f inside of my fucking mouth so much. So much. Okay, I don't really have a lot. I got a cute little dress from Rue 21. And it was on clearance. I got it for 12 bucks. It says 15, but there was extra. It was like 11 something. And then it, I think it was like 11 whatever. And then it came out. I just didn't receive it. But I thought it was so cute. Of course, black. What else? What other color am I going to fucking buy? But it's super cute. It's like a high low. And I don't know how well you can see it. Probably not. But it's got this little like lace detail. Can you guys? What is that weird shading? Anyway, it's got a cute little lace detail. I got this at a 2X. And it's a high low. Should I try it? On? Maybe I'll try it on a minute. Hold on. Because then I also got from Torrid. I only bought four things. Well, I know I told you. But I got two new bras. I got a nice black one to really, really caress the girls. This is a nice one. I thought it was like, you know, it was nice. And it's nice and wide here. Cause I need like a neck cause my lymphedema on this side, I have a lymphedema pocket here and it's just so embarrassing. I hate it so much. Stupid surgery. And then this one said it was a t-shirt. Look how wide this is. Like that's nice and wide and it actually buckles in the front. So I was like, Ooh, like this is cool. So I'm going to try these. And they had my size, which was a 44C. That is my bra size. Well, actually, okay. I go back and forth because when I was at my smallest, which was like 230 something, I could fit into a 42C and it was comfortable, but it was starting to get a little loosey goosey. But now that I'm back up to 260, I gained 30 pounds. My 42Cs, even though they fit, they cut me. They cut me right in the gizzards, like right right here. That's I know that's not gizzards, but they cut me. And especially this side, and I don't know why. I don't know if it's because all the tension from this side is pulling this side. I don't fucking know because I have the lymphedema pocket here. But for some reason, this side always cuts me. Like the last time, like I have a really cool like tattoo artist, like tattoo flash paper um light blue bra and stuff but last time i wore it it cut the fuck out of me and it hurt and i'm like i just wore this fucking bra not that long ago and now it like bothers me but towards the only place i really like to get bras because they work okay and then like i said i got the jean jacket like little Cardi's like how freaking stinking cute do you know how many dresses I will wear now in the summer just because of these like for real for real so I did get the blue because I already got the one from Shein you guys remember so I do I got the blue and I got the white I got the blue and the white one because I used to have one from Lane Bryant, which I'm so mad they took the Lane Bryant out of the mall. But yeah, I got the blue and I got the white. I got them both in a three, but that's only because I know my arms are, I'm so much bigger at the top. I'm so disproportionate. Like my left leg's bigger than my right leg. My waist is smaller than my gut. Like, <sighs> I put pants up to fit me and then they just slide down. Like, I swear. Okay, should I try this? I'm gonna try the skirt on, but, or the dress, but I'm leaving my leggings on because I don't know how short, how short it's gonna be. Like, this is cute, right? I mean, I wouldn't have these leggings on clearly. I don't know how well y'all can see it. I wouldn't have these particular leggings on. Look how cute this little crop jacket is. 
Like this is gonna be my savior this time. Of course, I don't have a good brow on either. My only problem is, yeah, that's really cute. With my good, with a good bra on. What do y'all think? Is she cute? Is she cute? I think she's pretty cute. Should I put on the white jacket? My only problem is, is that I need to figure out what to do for a compression. Um, because I don't like, that's what sucks because there's like so many spaghetti straps, like even with cold shoulders. And there was like one that I saw at, um, Torrid and I was going to get it, but I'm like, I gotta wear my compression tank and the straps are so damn long. But even like wifey gets these, like, I call them chicken breast cutlets, but they're like the bras you stick on, you pull them up and and they look like chicken breast cutlets, but they're sticky. So you put you put the little chicken breast on and then you pull it up and it sticks to you. And then you can have, they look like tatas. So I want to get the, the, maybe get some chicken breast cutlets and make it look like, you know, whatever, whatever. And then, um, but if I can find a compression tank for my midsection it's kind of like shapewear but it's just like it's it's tight and it like compresses and make sure it like keeps the fluid moving you know what i'm saying um so look at that that's so cute like i would i would wear this to work i mean i would wear i have a lot of bike shorts and stuff I even have like lace bike shorts, but how cute is that? I think it's cute. I think it's freaking adorable. I like these. I'm so glad I got these because I really contemplated it. But my summer is just going to be so much better because I'm going to probably wear the fuck out of these all goddamn summer like no bullshit i'm probably gonna wear these because i hate my arms and even though my arms are exposed a wee bit it's i still feel more covered than, and i think i could roll them down a little bit too yeah they're just kind of rolled up some but yeah i can roll them down so and they're actually a little big like i can but I had to buy them big for my arms and for my wide back. But like, I could even just button this up and wear it as like a little crop top with like some jeans pulled up or something. Like tuck a, I can put like a tuck a tank top in or something. I don't know. I don't know. I came this close to buying that little lace bodysuit. Cause then I was like looking for little things to wear under my stuff. Oh, plus that's right. I still got that Timu clothes. Those Timu clothes coming. I don't know, but I do. I like this. I like this dress a lot. So I'm glad I got it. it. Was like I said, 11 bucks. What's up, beautiful people? Okay, I am packing hubby's lunch, and I'm like trying to like get some shit done and whatever. Um, and I wanted to have my excuse you i wanted to have my boston cream yo play it's not for you it's not for you oh my god mm. Mm. move it's so good i just licked the lid Mm. that's so good it's just like the cream I miss ba like Boston cream pies <laughs> there's a joke in there somewhere chocolate eclairs mm. this is good soup 
good good soup all right friends it is that time of night i'm going to bed well i'm gonna finish playing my game and then i'm gonna go to bed because i didn't play all day and then actually i'm gonna do this and then edit the vlog and then go upstairs and lay down just because so all right guys i love you all so 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 very much please remember to like comment share and subscribe and as always please be kind because you don't know what kind of battle someone's going through so don't be a dick thanks all right guys i love you all oh so 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 very much and i will see you in the next video bye